this weekend, I got so many examples of ways to be grateful for challenges, from personal ones in my relationship to viewing others' challenges in groups. And the thing that kept coming up is, where's the lesson? Happy Monday, everyone. It's Sophie. And me. We're always looking for new ways to support you, and we know firsthand how life can get in the way. So we've created five-minute episodes with motivation from us and our great friends to keep you feeling ignited and inspired no matter what life throws at you. Welcome to the Ignited Motivation Podcast. Mini episodes every Monday. Listen while you brush your teeth. Or on your morning walk. And you'll never miss out on the latest tips and tricks that are keeping us feeling motivated. The act, the practice, the habit of finding gratitude is a skill that we hone not as a way to ignore our challenges, not as a way to be Pollyannic about what's happening in our lives, not as a tool to push down or numb or ignore what we need to show up for in our lives, but instead to refine the approach and the attitude the perception, the motivation, and the perspective that we have on our lives as we approach all those challenges. Our strength, our resiliency, our grit to show up to what we need in life is boldened, is strengthened, is fortified by our ability to look inside and find that strength, find the things that make us who we are, even in the face of those challenges. That's the true difference between a good week and a bad week. This weekend, I got so many examples of ways to be grateful for challenges, from personal ones in my relationship to viewing others' challenges in groups. And the thing that kept coming up is, where's the lesson? Where's the opportunity to get better? And with that orientation, not only do we get to be grateful for the simple things that are there with us all the time, like our breath, our health and well-being, and all their varying forms as they shift and change throughout the days and the months and the years, to our gifts, our loves, our strong relationships, not only do we get to be grateful for those, we also, be great. we also get the chance to be grateful for all the things that got us to this place. And if you're like every other human being that I've ever met in my life, some of the things that brought you here were really challenging. Some of those experiences, those events, those relationships, those time frames in your life were hard. They took effort, they took focus, they took motivation, they took collaboration, they took that grit, they took the motivation. But here's the thing I know with 100% certainty is you made it through all those times. You're here. You just listened to the Ignited Motivation Podcast. Did you love the mini dose of motivation? Please let us know. Your feedback and experience is our number one motivator. Leave us a review, subscribe, and share with your favorite people on your favorite apps. And don't forget to catch the next episode every Monday. Because we want to hear from you. So join the conversation and discover bonus content on our website and Instagram. You can find the links in the show notes. Now that you're ignited, what are you motivated to take on?